the solar eclipse normally occurs twice every year. However, the April 8, 2024 solar eclipse could be one of the most unique phenomena in recent years, at least from the perspectives of metaphysics. The April 2024 eclipse is neither a partial solar eclipse. This is also not an annular solar eclipse. But the coming solar eclipse will be a total solar eclipse. And of all places, this rare total solar eclipse would once again be taking place across North American region, particularly the United States. So here we are, the Great American Eclipse is back once again. What makes this even more intriguing for metaphysicians, particularly in Chinese metaphysics studies, is that places such as Washington DC, New York City and even Canada's capital Ottawa could be experiencing 90% of obscuration effect from the partial eclipse. Being at this point, some may like to ask what is so significant about this great American eclipse of 2024 since there were plenty of other total solar eclipses across the world as well as the previous total solar eclipse across the United States back in August 2017. Here, one of the significance is because if there is gonna be any major shakeups in the United States, this will indeed cause some impact globally. So, as claimed by some well-known Jumancers, one of the major outcomes from the 2017's total solar eclipse was the start of the trade war between the United States and China that kick-started the shifts in global geopolitics which had lasted until today. Also, some have claimed that although back with massive support from the voters, President Trump still managed to lose the subsequent presidential elections back in 2020 due to his direct exposure to the August 2017's eclipse. Whether this could be true or not, I would suggest that we rather err on the side of caution during this period of volatility. Although the total solar eclipse could not be witnessed across Asia and many other regions, many of us may still want to take note because this great American eclipse of April 2024 will be much nearer to Washington DC this time around, and whether we like it or not, Washington DC is still the center of global power. Plus, New York City is still holding the cloud as the world's most influential and powerful financial center. Since this solar eclipse will be nearer to Washington DC and New York City compared to the 2017s, in my opinion, there is a greater possibility that the implications from the 2024's Great American Eclipse may have wider and far-reaching consequences, particularly regarding shifts within global geopolitics, global trade, and even shifts in relations amongst global leaders. While I could be very wrong on this, I would like to take this opportunity to share some of my observations on the probabilities from this great American eclipse that we can possibly derive from the Patsu chart of 8th of April 2024. The first observation could be aspect relating to global financial and monetary matters. This is due to the obvious fact that run water is actually the wealth element to the 2024's annual part of the chart. Observation number two points to the aspect relating to errors in making major decisions by certain major power leaders. If you could see, the appearance of two dragon animal signs in the part of the chart signify the self-punishment configuration which could possibly imply indecisiveness, hasty policy making, or being caught in a catch-22 situation that eventually adds to the current volatilities. Observation number three is where the run water has the potential to combine and transform President Biden's Ding Fire Day Master into Jia Wood, which happens to be his direct resource star. In parts of speak, the direct resource star also signifies the general well-being and health aspect of a person. I must stress that this observation does not imply negative implications by any mean because any sort of outcome must be compounded by one's decision and action during that period of time. On the other hand, the potential combine and transform in this sense means it's just meant to provide some guided anticipation towards the possibility of unforeseen disruptions. The fourth observation will be the constellation of heart that coincides with this day of total solar eclipse. In general, the heart constellation does carry some unfavorable connotations towards matters such as monetary, finance, trade, and commerce activities. Since this constellation is pointing back to monetary and finance matters once again, maybe we can expect new revelations 
or some sudden and aggressive policy changes happening across monetary, finance, trade and commerce sectors in the months to come. These observations are merely possibilities and meant to be a tool of anticipation. Whether this could turn out to be true or not, we know that most of the implications will still be out of our control. So, on a personal level, the suggestion here is to remain indoors and refrain from being entirely exposed to the solar eclipse path this coming 8th of April 2024, more so if you live near or within the path of totality. Once again, as long as the eclipse can be seen from your locality, try to refrain yourself from being exposed to the entire eclipse process from the start until the end of the eclipse based on your locality and local time. Besides, you can look forward to leverage and activate the 2024 Sky Horse Feng Shui location as well as leveraging on the auspicious Feng Shui Period 8 building that faces to Southeast 2 and Southeast 3 directions during the entire month of April. You can head over to these videos with the links attached in the description box below. Till then, I'll see you in the next video and please consider to subscribe us. Thank you once again.